Did it start? Hey everyone. Got a real surprise for you today. I am cutting my clutch of eggs. I need to look in that corner. Ain't I? I'm not used to using this just yet. So real quick, I had a clutch. I'm gonna bring you in closer. I might just show you the card. Whoop. I had a clutch laid about 54 days ago. And I came home and I was just checking on them uh, just to see like, how are they doing? Cause I'm feeding my adults uh, right now. And it's driving me crazy waiting for day 55 to cut these eggs. Um, so when I took a peek real quick, I found out that, or I saw that one of the snakes heads was poking out and I didn't get a good glimpse cause all I saw was just something move in really fast. And I was like, oh my God, I gotta get a camera. So, uh, I am totally jazzed to cut this. I actually bred her, uh, I can't show you the parents just yet. They're both eating and or occupied. So I don't wanna get bit uh, just yet or actually I prefer them to eat first. So I'll show the parents to this pairing later. Um, I did breed my female lesser uh, Mirage to my male lesser Meringue in hopes of more white snakes. Hopefully I do get a bunch. I'm thinking there might be four in this clutch. I think that'd be great. Um, I need a male to hold back to replace his father. Um, if not, I did throw in my crazy five gene combo male that I will show you. He's in shed, so I can't show you him either. I know, what a shame. Uh, but so this clutch was seven eggs, one slug. Um, I believe I had one very small egg. That egg did not make it. Uh, so I have just six good eggs and I'm gonna get in here and show you what is going on. I'm gonna cut these for you guys. So let's see if I can get you a, just got a new stand. Do, 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 do. There we go. I think that means you guys can see. Okay. There we go. Cool. Let's do this. Now, let me show you that egg that already got himself, herself, themselves. Check that out. This one already Wolverine the egg a bit. It's day 54. Let's see if I can zoom in. There we go. So they're already ready to hatch. So there's no harm in getting in here. Yes, my scissors are sharp, but I've done this quite a few times. I've never hurt a baby. I would like to try Billy for Mutation Creations way of cutting eggs with the big scissors. I think that was really cool when I first saw it. I was like, you know what, that's genius. One quick swipe and they're all done. Well, I already know what this is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And look at that. I'm using my phone, guys, so bear with me. Oh, put your nose out. There we go. <laughs> when I cut this open, his head was at the very top, or its head was at the very top. So, one blue eyed leucistic. Oh my goodness. I do this thing where I wet my hands after every egg. Oh, that's so awesome. If I have multiple of these, um, they will be for sale. I do have a Morph Market page. It's under uh, JC Pythons. But um, none of these guys will be available until they shut out and eat, had a few meals, and I'm very comfortable with them leaving my care. But uh, until then, at least I'll grace you guys with a video. Ooh, what's this? I'll be sure to also do some updates for you guys when they come out and then when they shed and all that good stuff. Oh, what? Okay, okay, okay. Come here. Ah, don't know how to do this without making a huge mess. Ah, just like that. Look at this. I think my boy Roulette made a baby in here. Roulette is a uh, orange dream. Let's see, I have to look at his tag because he's, he's a mouthful. Super pastel, orange dream, leopard, fire. I think that's correct. Let me see, super pastel, it's two copies of the pastel gene. Leopard, orange dream, fire, yes. 
And uh, that looks a lot like a leopard Mojave. You'd have to have pastel since he's a super. You can't get away without one gene of those. I think that's what that is. Uh, gosh darn, I'm gonna have to zoom in for you guys. Yeah, that's got the pastel lips, white lips. Oh my God, no way. <laughs> this will be my first dual side clutch uh, if that is what I think it is. Oh, I'm sorry guys. I think I got a better way of getting you, getting you guys closer. Maybe, no, not so much still. I'm gonna have to play with this a little bit more. Hopefully uh, bringing them in closer for you guys is working. Do, 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 do. It's always crazy when you're waiting for uh, eggs to hatch because you, you, know, you just walk by the incubator every day and it's you know roughly 60 days so you got two months of of waiting and it's pretty uh pretty painful to wait to say the least oh shazam another white beauty check that out now the blood's normal it's just like if uh say you're a human you were to give birth or anything like that there's blood involved like as in most things so no harm i'm not cutting anything major i'm not cutting the snake at all so I'm not concerned. Um, as I said, one already decided to pop its head out. So there's no harm in cutting them now. They're pretty much ready. Uh, so when I was pairing, uh, when I was pairing my snakes together, I was uh, using roulette as a backup male since he is a super pastel combo. I figured no harm. If I get some babies from him, that'd be great because I wanted some babies from him this year anyway, and I wasn't sure if he was gonna gonna make it. Oh yes, check this out. Look at this. Look at this. Look at those patches. I really gotta show you the parents to these uh, when they come out because it's wild. Look at that. Holy cow. Oh my god, that's so cool. This is my first ever dual sired clutch. Oh my god. I couldn't tell what some of these were when I was candling them, because usually you can candle at about five weeks of age and you can see the pattern developing on the snakes through the shell. I mean, white snakes are really easy. Egg just goes pink, just like when they're developing, and then you never see any pattern uh, as time goes on. So I candled them a couple days ago. And, um,. There's a few, I think there's four white snakes in here, I think, and then two of these fellas, but I wasn't too sure, it was hard to see. Um, but I am really beside myself right now. I'm just gonna upload this raw footage <laughs> and you can listen to me gawk and babble on and make mistakes. I'll get better as time progresses, I hope. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna be keeping some more animals back, it looks like. Doo -doo -doo. I know the anticipation must be killing you guys. I have no idea what else is in here. Don't know if you guys heard that hiss. I got a rat in with an adult. Oh, looks like just a lesser. I think. Doo -doo -doo. Getting it all over the kitchen counter. So just a lesser, I think. I'm gonna pull you guys in closer at the end of this so I can get you guys some better views. Sound chill? Oh, sorry, little one. I know you're poking your head out. I'm trying to see what this crazy human's doing. Last one. So if, say, um, I had two lessers together, out of six eggs, I should have had maybe two blue-eyed blue cystics, so two white snakes with blue eyes. Uh, let's see, out of six eggs. Hmm. Well, out of four, if I can do it out of four, a lot easier than out of six. Out of uh, four eggs, one white snake, two lessers, one normal. Out of six eggs, do any magical combination of those. So, I wasn't really expecting anything other than just white snakes out of this. And I'm not unhappy by any means. Uh, <sighs> and here's another one. Boop. Another white snake, wow. 
holy cow i was not expecting that so i wasn't i was like i said i was expecting maybe a normal maybe two uh this pairing with um my male lesser and my female lesser together two years ago gave me four viable eggs um what hatched was three normals and one one lesser all females so at least the uh, sex ratio worked out in my favor but none of the gene combinations did. I didn't get any white snakes. Uh, definitely a shame. Um, and this time, I think I only paired Roulette, the Super Pastel, yada, 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 to Mirage once. I believe I paired him to her one time mid-season. And it looks like two of these babies are his, and not just just pastel lessers. These look like at least leopard in both of these. Pastel, of course, has to be in them. And I think this one has the lesser gene in there. So I'm gonna take you off the stand and get you closer. Let me see. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Gotta just edit this video real quick. Hang on. I'm ready for my close-up. So we have one white snake. Two white snake making bubbles. Look how cute he is. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I keep thinking it's a he. I need a male. <laughs> Could be a her for all I know. Another white snake. A, gosh. I don't know if that's all five and one. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to <laughs> look it up and give it some time. Uh, I'm gonna guess. Um, Pastel, Lesser, Leopard, Orange Dream, maybe Fire. So that might be the five gene combo. Goodness. Um, I don't even care what gender or what sex this animal is. I, I'll just be happy with either. A male would be great for a backup. Um, a female even better to grow up, I think. So praying that's a girl. You know, it'd be nice if this one's a girl too. Oh, yeah. You. As you can see, folks, they're fantastic. No bug eyes, even even though they are a super lesser. That is a a thing that can happen if you have a, a blue-eyed leucistic made with two lessers. Oops, fingers in the way. But uh, those guys look great. This one, um, I'd say pastel lesser leopard at the mo at the minimum. I'm not sure if there's. Orange Dream or Fire, I'm going to have to wait until they all come out, but holy cow. Oh, one last baby. Holy cow, I can't be any happier. I really can't. There's a nice little lesser in there. Hello. So, holy cow. All right, folks, I'll let you know when these poke their heads out. I'll do another update for you. When they crawl, I'll do an update for you. Shed, of course, and, uh, We'll see you then. <laughs> Thanks for watching.